All right. Uh, the gate was 2.9 million. The attendance was 17,800. It was a total sellout. Uh, the performance of the night went to Moicano and Dillashaw, and the fight of the night was DJ and Cejudo. They all won $50,000. Congratulations to them. All you guys doubted me, each and every one of you. <laughs> Man, it's, uh, it's, it, it's, a, it's a true testimony of, of an underdog. Um, man, I, I lasted the first fight with Demetrius Johnson two minutes and 36 seconds. And uh, I felt like it was going that way that very first round, too, when he made he, the, the, those cab kicks, man, really, I couldn't, I couldn't plant. And uh, I was forced to switch southpaw, but it actually helped me. And uh, before all this, I, I said in order for me to beat the Demetrius, it, it had to do with distance, timing, and composure. And that's exactly how we took this fight. You know, I took this fight. He got to my legs, and that was okay. I wanted Demetrius to work. And uh, man, it's, it's just, this is surreal, man. This is surreal. This is a kid who grew up, who I'm sorry, who was born, you know, 10 miles away from the Staples Center, the ghetto streets of South Central LA, to Mexican immigrants, to, uh, you know, being an Olympic champion at the age of 21, where my mother wasn't able to go to the Olympics due to, due, due to her citizenship status, to, you know, her becoming a, a US citizen about eight years ago, and then me now, you know, 10 years later, being an Olympic champion, now carrying UFC gold, man. It really is. Uh, a dream come true. On August 19th, I became the youngest in history to ever win an Olympic gold medal. And on August 4th, I, I defeated the man, the myth, the legend, Demetrius Johnson, man. It feels super good. I'm fine. You know, losing happens. Every great champion loses. Um, I, I've lost before. You know, when I fight Dom, I lose in the gym. So I'm fine. I'm more upset about the injuries, but other than that, I'm okay. What do you mean the injuries? Uh, I think I probably tore my right LCL and then my right foot might be broken. Oh, it's good, man. No matter who it is, you know, getting out there and getting your hand raised is very satisfying. So, yeah, but a little extra, you know, a little extra back there just kind of, it's done. Close that chapter. I'm in too good a shape to let off the throttle, you know. Uh, he's not going to be able to recover. I'm going to be able to push the pace always. I mean, I think that's my fighting style is that I'm always going to bring it. I'm going to push the pace as hard as I possibly can all the time.